pull a nigga, then we die. In it, pull him to the side, let me slide. In it. Hi guys, what's up? It's your girl, it's Kimami. We are back with another motherfucker on video. So disclaimer, these are not my songs I'm playing, okay? I do not purposely play these songs, so if you hear these songs in the background, just know it's not me, okay? Before we get started, make sure you like, make sure you comment down below, make sure you subscribe if you haven't already to join our group gang family, LM Sauce. But without further ado, let's get into the video. Just another disclaimer, sorry I have so many disclaimers because I have to have them. Besides the music in the background, any noise you hear in the background, I am I apologize in advance. I really do. I don't mind how I look right now. It's really time for bed. You no, know, my child, she's literally looking at me eating fucking chips. Cause she just got done eating dinner and drinking her drink. So now she's eating a snack. After that, we'll lay that back down. Cause I know she's still tired. Let's get into the video. Story time is about how I was supposed to fight two girls and they didn't show up okay they didn't want to fight me whatever the case may be they just did not show up not because i was scary not because oh let's not fight let's just talk no when when i get to the point of i want to fight you there's no more talking <laughs> i might call you a bitch bit 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 like repeatedly as i'm hitting you or something like that but honestly there's no more there's no more talking it's all hands at this point point. and if you try to play unfair just no I got something for that. I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. Before the people take that the wrong way. Oh my gosh, she got it. no, no, I do not. Don't even try to do that. I don't have none of the sort. You know what I mean? You know what I mean? Okay. We understand what I'm throwing down. We understand what I'm throwing down. If you don't, you just miss the mark. Number one, try to figure it the fuck out. I was friends with these two girls. I, I know what you're thinking. Friends with this. Yeah, 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 it was, okay? But let me explain to y'all who these people are as far as, like, give y'all a little backstory about them and how we corresponded with each other and then what was it about and then, you know, just the whole thing leading up to what happened. We're gonna call them Daisy and Sweet Pea. These are two names of flowers, so I don't want nobody to say no bullshit of, oh, that's somebody's name. No, it's nobody's name, not even close. The third person that we will be talking about in this video will be named family member because that's what they were. Now that we got names out the way, let's head into backstories. So, me and Sweet Pea have been friends longer than me and Daisy. Okay, me and Sweet Pea have been friends since like, well not anymore. Me and Sweet Pea have been friends at this point in time, since the 8th grade. Now, me and Daisy, we've been friends like maybe a year and a half, maybe two years after that. You know, she talks shit about everybody. She thinks she's she's one of them ones. She sits on her high horse looking down, nose up at everybody type shit. Sweet Pea is more the type of person like she makes or not makes. She lets everybody else fight her battles. She doesn't really fight her battles, okay? She's a little timid, a little shy, a little scary type of person. Not trying to talk shit, but that's really how it was. Like if anybody met her and seen her go through a situation, she's not really the type to confront fight none of that now family member obviously that's my family i'm not sure if it was sophomore or junior year friends with daisy i'm friends with sweet pea and then my family member goes to school with me because she's around the same age as me daisy had the same class as me as far as history me and sweet pea had the same class as far as math and then sweet pea daisy and my family member all had the same class around the end of the day before it's time to go home for home from school obviously i have to go through the day going into classes with them before they end up in the class with my family member so it comes this one day right i'm more like when it comes to confrontation i'm going to do it like, i have facts before i just come to you and say oh what well, so and so said or so and so said or this person said or that person said like no we're not doing that i need facts first before i come to anybody with no bullshit we went through the school day and at the end of the school day my family member tells me, so you need to get your little friends. And I'm like, get my little friends? What my little friends do? And obviously I knew exactly what she's talking about because she didn't like neither one of them. Which should have been a motherfucking red flag. Well, not red flag for her, but it should have been a, a red flag for me to see. Like, she got a good eye. She can see, she can tell. You know what I mean? But no, I just tried to give people the benefit of the doubt and 
look what they did. You know what I mean? What, what, what happened was problem. She tells me, your little friends is talking shit about me. And I'm like, talk shit about you about what the fuck they say. Like, I'm already getting heated because what you mean they talk shit about you. Because if they talk shit about you, what the fuck they saying about me? You feel what I'm saying? And one of them know me a little bit more than the other one. So you obviously know they talking to each other. So now this bitch knows something. Daisy knows something now. And Daisy is more that talker, talker, talker of one. She gonna let everybody know your business. She don't even know how to keep her own business to herself. Like, she's really one of them ones. I'm not sure nowadays because I don't have her on no social media. She was definitely one of them. So, not a good friend from the jump. You know what I mean? Because you mean to tell me if we get into it and it's something small, you're gonna post it. And it was just like, you know, if sweet people running that mouth to Daisy, Daisy can let right now. So, it's just kind of like, fuck. That's why I didn't let everybody know my business or my one-two step. You know what I mean? Now that I know that they talk shit about my family member, she ain't gonna come to me and lie and say some shit like that. If she was to do that, she would have been done it a long time ago within the friendship that I have with them too. She tells me, she said, yeah, they said this, they said that, da 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 So I said, oh, okay, bet. Bet it up, like literally bet the fuck up. So I'm already heated, I'm like, no, nah, y'all ain't no good friends. How dare you talk about my family members? Like y'all got room to fucking talk. Both of y'all have family problems just like anybody else in the motherfucking world do. So like, why well, talk about mine? You know what I mean? What made mine overtop y'all's? And honestly, in real talk, I feel like y'all's overtop mine. But hey, who the fuck am I? I said, you know what? Don't worry about it. She said, so what's gonna happen? I said, don't worry about it. I'm gonna talk to them first. I need to hear what the fuck they gonna say. And if they want to fight, they can meet us at the park, right next to the house. The school day come past. I finally pulled them to the side and said, so what the fuck y'all been saying about my family member? And they was like, I ain't saying, I ain't saying shit, I ain't saying shit. I said, no the fuck, you're lying. Like, you're lying. I can I can see right now the face you're giving me, the tone you're giving me, body language, you're lying. <laughs> Tell me what the fuck you said. And we can do it right now. But if you don't want to tell me what you said, we can get down right now. Or we can get down after school. Because honestly, I don't want no school fight. I don't want this shit to be broken up. Like, we're going to do some shit where we can get some minutes in. <laughs> Let's round it up. Because I'm going to take my anger out on you. And you don't know that. Like, it will literally feel like the devil himself has entered the chat. Because again, I'm not, I'm not one of those, like, I don't just want to fight every fucking female I see. Or every female that has a problem. Like, no. And some people think that they can take me to certain lengths and that's the problem. If you think that something is going to get to me for real, for real, and take this take this video as an, as an example. People use, oh, let me talk about her family real quick to see what she going to do. That's not going to get to me. You don't understand. You just do not understand what's cooking in the pot. So boom, I confronted them the next day. Literally gave them the facts, gave them what I knew for a fact that I know they could say. And literally just handed it, handed it to them. Like literally, I'm giving y'all space and opportunity to let me know what the fuck you actually did. Don't fucking lie to me. I already can see past the bullshit. Like you already know this. <laughs> Why are y'all sitting there talking shit about my family member? Like, and they they tried to flip it and be like, no, she said da 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 da. I said, you know what? Since y'all y'all gotta keep fucking lying, y'all gonna y'all gonna keep doing all this stupid ass shit. You know what? Meet me after school. Meet me at blah 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 park. Y'all already know where that's at. That's right by my crib. I will meet y'all there. School, get out. They said, okay, okay, okay. Don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. Cool. I don't give a fuck. I said, meet me there. I said, I meant what I said. I stand on that. Ten toes down. It gets it gets out of school. I'm heated. I'm ready. Ready to go. I'm going home. Can change my shorts. My just around. Spring, summertime, so it's already time for that season. You know what I mean? Mind you, obviously me and my family member ride the bus home together. So she's already mad. I'm already mad. She said, you know what? I'm going to go with you to make sure that they ain't going to jump you. I said, you know what? I can't handle my own, but you know what? You can't go there just in case they try to bring their family members. And, you know, ours live right there, so what the fuck? So, whatever, cool. Um, I get home. I said, you know what? I'm going there two hours early. I don't even give a fuck. I'm ready for these bitches to pull the fuck up. I need to see what the fuck is going to go down. Stay there two hours. I text them. I said, where you at? Where you at? Where you at? Then no response. No response. Mind you, I knew their schedules like the back of my fucking hand. Maybe not so much daisies, but I do know sweet peas like the back of my hand. 
So, sweetie, you live over here by me. And come to find out, Daisy, you did too. What the fuck is that? Like, wait. We finally get to round point to see that they're not coming. So, we're like, I said, I'm gonna text them one last time if they don't text back or they don't say that they already on their way, blah, 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 blah. Or some sort of, I'll be there in a second. Something. So like, give me something. You know what I mean? Give me something. Because you're not giving me anything. I'm not going to keep sitting here and look stupid. Like, obviously, clearly, you didn't want to get, you didn't want to fight. You know what I mean? So, I won the battle. I, I did. Like, I showed up. I confronted you. If you was really my friend, you would not have done that shit in the first place. I'll see you guys in the next video. I love you guys all to bits and pieces. So don't say I didn't say I love you today because if nobody told you, I did. Okay? But see you guys in the next video. I love you guys and bye. Ciao.